Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Google Decides My Makeup Challenge and this challenge has been done by a few beauty YouTubers already so I'm kind of late to the game. I meant to film it earlier but didn't have time to. The challenge is really really simple. All you have to do is to go to Google, type in your initials and add in the word look. You are supposed to take the first result of Google Images and that should be the photo that inspires your makeup look. <laughs> It is a toilet. I'm very, very, very thankful that it's not a shit splattered toilet. It's a very clean and nice looking toilet. There is a sink, there is a mirror, there is a towel which is brown, the floor is parquet, the wall is this like speckled grey, and then there is a bidet as well as a normal white colour porcelain toilet bowl. It's a makeup look inspired by a toilet. As far as toilets go, this is not too bad, I guess. <laughs> so let's get started. First step, I'm going to be putting on contact lenses and I've got myself some uh, grey colour contact lenses here and I chose something a little bit more like the walls speckled grey kind of colour Why must my initials be WC? My mama, why you never think about this? Anyway, it could have been worse My name could have been Monica and then it would be Monica Chung. Get it? Like more cartoon. Okay, so next step, I'm going to be putting on my primer. So I'm going to be using my trusty professional primer. Get into the pores so that I don't look so old. So you're telling me this entire video, you're not going to shoot my cleavage. What are the guys going to watch? Watch me filling up my pores. Periodically, just zoom down a little bit. Okay, so for my foundation, I'm going to be using this YSL CC Cream. I have had this for a really long time, I don't know if it's discontinued. Let's put this on my face with a beauty blender. See how white it is. Let's put more. I think I'm going to have more is more tattooed on my forehead, so you guys don't forget. One of the best philosophies in life. Because if less is more, then less would be called more. But less is called less, so more is more. Okay. <laughs> I still don't think it looks very white, but never mind. I have my Fenty Beauty here. Okay, so I've got this white colour mascara here. I'm going to try to put it on my brows now, see whether it actually manages to cover my brows. I think I cannot go for white colour brows because I feel like the white colour mascara is not really covering the brows that much. So I'm going to go to my Urban Decay Moon Dust Palette and I'm just going to try to draw some like silver brows on with this graphite colour. Okay, that went pretty okay. There's contact lenses right just now, got water inside. Just use that, then you don't have to go to the toilet to take it. I've got the silver on, I'm going to try to put more of the white on. I'm going to try to use this white colour eyeliner to draw some white hairs on it. Hey, okay, that works. So I think the eyebrows kind of look like the wall, so we've got one part of the WC look nailed down. I'll just do something very very basic which is to contour the face. I'm just going to use brown because there's brown in the picture, so I'm going to be using this Tarte Hamptons Weekender. I really really like this palette a lot, I've been using it a lot for my travels lately because it contains like three different colours. I'm just going to use the brown shade which is for the contour. Okay, I don't want to go over do this because overall I still want to have the very like white kind of look, I guess. How come my forehead is so shiny? Never mind, the toilet bowl is shiny too. So I've got my face contour done. Now it's contouring for the nose. I will get some under eye bags too. Squeeze it like that to see where it will come out. Next, I'm going to be doing my highlighter and today I chose the Jeffree Star highlighter because it's like freaking 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 shiny but it cracked. So shiny. Shine bright like a toilet bowl. Guys, who looks like a toilet bowl? Me. Mm, I'm a very very clean toilet bowl. Brand new ceramic. Toilet bowl with 10 years warranty. 
You know what? She just put it all over my whole face. Then I'll look like that X Men that's made of diamonds. I think she's called Emma Frost. Alright, so next I am going to go to the more interesting part which is eyeshadow. So I think I'll go for a very very opaque white at the all over the socket area first. So in order to make it very opaque, I'm going to be using NYX uh, Glitter Primer. I'm going to be using my Too Faced Glitter Bomb palette. It's very very cute. I super love this palette because look at it, there's like glitter inside and then you can move it around. And I am just going to be using the brightening base which is the white colour In order to make the white a bit more opaque, I actually have Kat Von D's white colour lipstick over here It's pure white I think this will actually stay longer than the powder so I'm just going to apply it for eyeshadow too Wow, this really works. I am going to try the very difficult task of attempting to blend it with silver grey and I don't really like using silver or grey on a normal basis because I feel that usually it just turns out looking really like kind of dirty and messy. So a lot of people like using grey eyeshadow. If you want to use grey eyeshadow, it kind of takes like a bit of an expert to blend it properly. So I would suggest just using brown instead which tends to look a lot more complementary on Asian skin. I'm using Kat Von D's Saint and Sinner palette which is this huge palette, very very useful palette to have. It's a very pretty palette and it comes with so many different colours. So right now I'm going to be using the colour called Cathedral which is this steel kind of colour. This is definitely very um, toilet sink fixture colour, maybe a gopher. Uh -huh. This look is a little bit too simple, so I think I'm just going to add a bit more of like glitter to it. Let's go ahead and put this on. So I'm using this glitter from LA Splash. Okay, I think it looks quite nice. In fact, it looks a bit bridal. Who wants me to do their makeup for their wedding? I will do this. Oh, it looks really shiny and nice in the light. Too bad my toilet bowl is not sparkly. Swarovski and Crass toilet bowl. Wow, but very filthy. Eh. Cannot, cannot. Suddenly so remember that NKF guy who had that gold like cap fixture. What's his name? Titi Burai. Maybe he will like this makeup look. He will be like, girl. You should have chosen a gold toilet bowl. I feel like for him, right, like his fate has already been sealed because his name is T dot T and it just looks like a crying emoji. No matter what he does, his ad life will end up crying. Okay, so now that I'm done with the glitter, I'm just gonna apply some brown, dark brown eyeshadow under my eyes because there is some brown here too. I'm going for this brown colour, which coincidentally I have also in my Kat Von D um, palette. Using the same brown to kind of draw the under eye bags too. So next step is eyeliner and I'm just going to go for a very simple black eyeliner. I've got my Dolly Wing black eyeliner here. Okay, so right now I'm going to apply my eyelashes. I haven't decided should I like go with white eyelashes or should I just use the default like black eyelashes. Let's just see how the white one looks like. Oh, it looks like like I'm a goose. Guess what, I'm not going to put this on because it's, it's a bit I'll just use the black one. So I forgot to bring my glue. I randomly found this in the studio. If you want to find out what glue I normally use, you can watch my all-time favourites video where I talk about eyelash glue too. Oh wow, this blue really truly fucking sucks. Where is it from? I'm going to burn down their factory. Mm. Is it staying? Mm. Okay. Stay ah, stay ah. It has flipped out already. 3000 hours later. Okay, I think I successfully managed to make it stay. Alright, so I'm just going to complete my eye makeup here by putting some mascara on my lower lashes. So let's go. Okay, so next I guess I will put on some blusher and I have with me my trusty NYX uh, makeup palette here. I mm, think I will use this colour. It is brownish, so kind of looks like the 
parquet flooring, I guess. For my lipstick, I'm going to use my white colour Kat Von D lipstick which I used just now. I guess this is how I look like with white lipstick. Really ugly. Okay, so I'm just going to try on this lipstick with the white to try to create like an ombre kind of effect, see whether that works. Okay, so this is definitely the parquet flooring colour. This is probably poisonous but I'm adding some like crucifix eyeshadow to my lips to make it a bit more brown. Don't try this at home. I'm not sure if it's edible. I'm pretty sure I won't die from it, that's okay. Next day, newspaper. Longer Shashir dies from eating eyeshadow. Okay, I made it a little bit more brown in the center. So I think I'm done with the whole makeup look right now. I just need to complete this image by putting on my white color wig. Alright, so I got my ugly white wig going on and also I feel like I look a bit dragged in this but okay. This is my look for the day to try to look like this WC look that Google decided for me. Over here, you can see the eyebrows are kind of like the wall, like a mixture of grey and white. And then we have the white hair of course with the white eyeshadow that kind of looks like the overall white. And then we have the brown which is under the eyes, this shade of brown and then the lips, I tried to do something less like that. I think it turned out a little bit more reddish than I expected it to but I tried my best and then over here we have the sink fixtures and the mirror that kind of just look really sparkly and silver so the eyeshadow. So I guess initially when I started out just trying to do this look I thought it would be a lot less wearable um, but somehow it actually looks pretty normal I would totally go out like this on a regular day I'm pretty pleased with how everything turned out um, I would have liked my face to be a little bit whiter in a more like scary manner like you know like really like ethereal kind of whiteness um, but I think the foundation kind of oxidized along the way so now it just looks like my normal skin colour I guess so if you ever want to look like a toilet you can totally go for this look okay <laughs> So don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that little bell icon so you get a notification every time a new video comes out and you can be the first to you know watch it and stuff and then you can leave one of those comments that say first, <laughs> very proud of you. And of course for the first one hour after I publish this video, I'll be staying around to chat with you guys so if you have any comments, questions, whatever, just leave them down below and I'll totally reply you guys. Okay so that's it, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!